Hi viewers, this is Engineer Mazhar Bas on my YouTube channel Civil Engineering Hell Depths. Today viewers, uh, as in my last video, I told you that uh, I will tell you about reinforcement of flat plate slab. Today we are on a flat plate slab and we are fixing the steel of this flat plate slab. First of all, you can see this, a lot of work has been done by the steel fixer and uh, viewers, this is main bar. The bar, this bar is main bar. As you see, this is the shortest span, approximately 56 feet. And this way is a long way. It is 156 feet, almost. So the bar which is in shorter direction is known as main bar. And the bar in long direction is known as uh, distribution bar. So there are multiple uh, spacing in this bar as this area approximately this area which is 13 feet uh, long has 8 inch uh, center to center spacing and this area is known as middle middle area in this middle area the spacing is also 8 inches and uh, same as this area the both and are the same and uh, uh, this is uh, also 8 inch center to center spacing here the main thing in this flat plate slab is shear reinforcement. What is shear reinforcement? You can see this on the face of column there are stirrups are given. These stirrups are known as shear force reinforcement. As you know this flat plate slab have no beam, no drop panel. So these shear rings are used to bear the load. These rings are used to counter the shear forces in this slab. So designer has designed these uh, reinforcement, these small rings, 10 inch by 11 inch. So these rings will counter the shear force in this slab. This is the main component of this uh, um, flat plate slab. If we, uh, if we did any mistake in this uh, reinforcement, the slab reinforcement will be failed. So as you can see this on every column, on every column these type of uh, reinforcement these type of shearings are provided by the designer so viewers in my next video i will share my drawing uh, of this slab and i will tell you uh, how i uh, that how i uh, used to make the bar bending schedule of this slab